Update out of Tuscaloosa. A man is in custody for a shooting death of a woman who was killed this morning. Get a look at the scene here. This is what authorities were, were working with today. And that wreck, that investigation, shut down part of 15th Street for hours this morning. Our West Alabama reporter, Brian Henry, joining us now live. Brian, what are we learning about what happened, the suspect? And I understand you also just learned the victim's name. That's right, Sarah and Jennifer. Authorities tell us it happened around 3 o'clock this morning, very close to I-359, 359, and 15th Street here in Tuscaloosa. A little more than an hour ago, police say they have arrested a 25-year-old man. They have identified him as Ladarius Bullock. Authorities say they are getting warrants right now. And just a few seconds ago, as you just mentioned, they identified the victim as Bernicia McIntyre's McIntosh. 28 years old. It is unclear for now what their relationship was or the alleged motive. Meantime, Tuscaloosa Police Chief Brent Blankley said earlier today the violence that we've all seen recently has got to stop. Uh, you know, you're making quick decisions that affect both parties for the rest of their life. You know, one person is deceased in this one, um, and, you know, somebody could go to prison for, you know, for the actions that they've committed once we fully investigate it. Um, just, you know, we just need to stop all the violence and as a, as a community come together. Um, this is senseless. There's no point in it and just come together as a community. Now, police say their investigation today included nearby surveillance video and interviews with several witnesses that apparently led them to the suspect. In Tuscaloosa, Brian Henry, WBRC Fox 6 News on your side.